So we're approximately two months away from Apple's biggest software event of the year. The Worldwide Developers Conference, WWDC 2025, will be happening from June 9th through the 13th. In today's video, I want to talk about the five things we can expect Apple to announce this year at their Worldwide Developers Conference 2025. Now, of course, WWDC is all about the software and Apple intelligence this year may gain additional capabilities and also expand to additional Apple software. Now, in terms of additional capabilities, it is heavily rumored that Apple will be integrating an additional third-party AI model into Apple intelligence, and that would be Google Gemini. Now, last year with the release of iOS 18.2, Apple added ChatGBT support for Apple intelligence. And obviously you can use ChatGBT on your iPhone right now as a third party model for Apple intelligent devices. And it is heavily rumored that this year at WWDC, Apple will be adding the additional model from Google, Google's very own Gemini. So we're looking forward to Gemini integration within iOS. It should work very similar to ChatGPT, where you ask your iPhone to use a specific model for a specific inquiry. Now there's also rumored that Apple for the first time will be bringing Apple intelligence to the Apple Watch with watchOS 12. Yes, so we've seen Apple intelligence on the iPhone, the iPad, the Mac, and of course, most recently on the Apple Vision Pro with Vision OS 2.4. And it is heavily rumored that Apple will be bringing Apple intelligence for the first time to the Apple Watch with watchOS 12 this year at WWDC. So yeah, two updates coming to Apple intelligence this year. Now, although WWDC is typically all about software, we've seen Apple also introduce new hardware in the past, such as brand new Max and this year it is heavily rumored that Apple will introduce for the first time ever a brand new tier of software called HomeOS. Now HomeOS would be a specific software targeted to manage your home using HomeKit on your device. However, it is also heavily rumored that Apple could announce new products alongside this new software. Now Apple has been working on a new doorbell with Face ID integration as well as a smart home device slash tablet HomePod that could allow you to manage and get things done around the home home using HomeKit and this new Home OS. So yeah, we could see a new Home OS announced this year at WWDC and who knows, perhaps even new products to launch alongside this new software. But as I mentioned, WWDC is all about the software and this year Apple will be introducing iOS 19, iPad OS 19, Watch OS 12, TV OS 19, Mac OS 16, and Vision OS 3.0 in form of beta one that will be happening the first day on June 9th and Apple has been heavily rumored to be redesigning iOS this year. The biggest redesign is rumored for iOS in over two decades. Now we've put this demo together so you guys can try it out. Links will be available in the description down below, but Apple is heavily rumored to add vision OS cues throughout iOS, a new look and more glassy look to iOS. And again, you can try out this demo right down in the description down below. You can go ahead and check it out as you can see right there, an entirely new look for iOS, iPadOS, and macOS is heavily rumored this year with the announcement of the next major update coming at WWDC. Those are going to be the five things, five plus things that we can expect Apple to announce this year at WWDC. Let me know if you're excited. We're approximately two months away. I'm really looking forward to iOS 19 this year. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.